Hi there, Megan McIntosh here. Welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to talk about what fish is good for you and what fish you should stay away from because of the high mercury content. Now, there's a new study that I read about in Diabetes Care that talks about people with high mercury exposure are 65% more likely to develop diabetes than people who have lower levels of heavy metals in their body. I read about the study in the Globe and Mail, an article by Leslie Beck, so I wanted to showcase these findings. Now, I don't eat any meat except for fish, so this is a big deal for me because I do eat fish. So the good fish that you want to continue in your diet, these are smart fish to eat, is black sea bass, clams, crab, and now Atlantic herring, and that's a good one because it's high in omega-3s, as well as Atlantic mackerel, which is also high in omega-3. Mussels are great fish, well, seafood. Atlantic pollock, salmon, high in omega-3s. Salmon that's wild and that's canned. Uh, sardines, scallops, sole and flounder, Stellhead trout, which is also high in omega-3s, and tilapia. So those are the fish that are high in omega-3 and that have less mercury. And usually it's the, the fish that are smaller fish that have less mercury because they're not the ones eating the other fish. Now, the ones that have more mercury tend to be the larger fish, so you want to not eat as many of these. So, grouper, swordfish, shark, marlin, Chilean sea bass, some types of tuna, king mackerel, escalar, orange ruffy, and tilefish. So those are the fish that tend to have more mercury than the other ones on the list. And they say that for canned tuna, canned ab albacore does have a higher content of mercury. So you might want to try the, the smaller, the lighter tuna, the skipjack tuna. And the types of tuna that are higher in mercury are albacore, big eye, black fin, and blue fin. And you might also want to look at eco-friendly fish, so because there's also other types of contaminants in the water, so you want to make sure that the fish is in water that's less polluted. So I hope this video has been helpful if you eat a lot of fish. So fish is good for your heart and it helps because of the omega-3, but if you have too much fish with the high mercury and the fish that are the, the fish that are eating the smaller fish, then you're gonna get the mercury in there. So just don't eat as much fish of those types. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. And I'm Megan McIntosh, signing out.